What does the MRI say? Hey guys, thanks for stopping in. Um, if you've seen several of my last videos I've been talking about, um, I've been having a lot of lower back issues. I've already had two lower back surgeries. The last one was in 1994 on uh, L4-5 and L5-S1. It was two levels. They just took part of the discs out. And um, lately I've been having a lot of problems. Actually, uh, I mean, I've had problems with my back ever since then. It's just been pretty crappy since then. But um, lately I've been getting not only more pain, but I've been getting numbness. I've been getting these weird shooting pains and like electrical shock type pains that sometimes wake me up in the night. I'll be in my foot or my toe or you know stuff like that weird stuff so the end of last year I decided you know I better make an appointment with a spine surgeon actually same guy I saw about five years ago and I was considering having a double spinal fusion and then I got really sick and had to have open heart surgery so that kind of went on the back burner but anyway I made an appointment with him and uh, Wednesday I went for an MRI which being squeezed in that tight little tube and with your shoulders like this is not too great when you have thoracic outlet syndrome. My hands were all stiff and swollen when I got out of the MRI machine. But anyway, so I have my MRI disc here and I go see the doctor on Wednesday, the spine surgeon. So. I've just, uh, I woke up early this morning and I was watching a few videos about spinal fusion, you know, how it's done and everything, and uh, it's kind of scary. I mean, the stuff I was watching was just one level, and I have two levels that may need to be done. I, I saw the, the x-rays of my lower back, and basically the doctor said everything is bone to bone, and also there's one vertebrae that vertebrae in there is kind of tipped so it's all everything's just kind of smashing the nerves so that's why I'm having problems so I will be turning 55 this year and he said it's probably just gonna keep getting worse with age so um, I'm thinking if it needs to be done maybe I should just go ahead and do it but um, not really something I'm looking forward to so <laughs> I've already had like I said two lower back surgeries in the past so I know what I'm getting into these things can be pretty brutal um, to recover from so um, uh, you know I'm really kind of dreading it like I said I watched a few videos about spinal fusion this morning and I'm like that's enough because they kind of started freaking me out a little bit sometimes I just uh, rather not know too much so you can start freaking yourself out for no reason so go to the doctor on Wednesday and um, I'll see what I find out then and if I end up having surgery I'll probably make some more videos about this although I'll probably be like out of commission for a while probably a good month I don't know if I'll be able to make any videos if I have surgery because I know from my past experience that it can be pretty excruciating going through back surgery so um, not really looking forward to that, to that. <laughs> sometimes I'm wondering what am I doing why am I making videos about this stuff but the way I look at it is I would like to be able to look at videos of from people that have gone through it and their experience you know so I'm thinking it may help be helpful to somebody else so stay tuned and I'll let you guys know what's gonna happen next thanks for watching and I'll talk to you next time